Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a tag video for you all. It's the mixed tag video and if you haven't noticed I am a mixed girl so I thought it was appropriate for me to do this tag. So I'm just going to get right into it and I am just going to read the questions off my phone. So yeah, let's just get started. What ethnicity... Oh shit, I can't say that word. What... I'm just going to reword the question so I can actually say the word. <laughs> what ethnic group are you most often mistaken for? The word is actually ethnicity. I can't say it, like, I just can't. It's not my dialect. I can't say it. Oh my god. <laughs> so yeah, what ethnic group do I normally get mistaken for? I often get mistaken for Filipino, Spanish, I don't know how, and sometimes Maltese. So random, but yeah. And then generally people do guess that I'm Chinese. Question number three, is your hair curly or straight? I would say that my hair is very, very wavy. Um, yeah, wavy. Four, was coming from different backgrounds challenging growing up? Um, it was difficult. At home, it wasn't that bad because it's my home. But I would say, um, like, going to school and stuff, it was super, super difficult for me, only because I was the only Asian person in the whole school. And the school had, like, a thousand people. And, like, they were so racist, bitches. What backgrounds do you embrace the most? I definitely embrace my Chinese side a lot more than I do my Australian side, um, just because what is Australian culture? Like, seriously. Have you ever been teased for being different? Hell yes. Mm. Like, I remember I used to come home every day crying. Fuckers. And I don't swear. Often. But I am so angry. Ah. Oh. So yeah, I definitely was teased in primary school and stuff. It wasn't that bad when I was in high school, but definitely in primary school, I did get picked on, like, every single day. Fuckers. Like, for a while, I tried to fit in, and then I realised they just weren't going to accept me, so I used to just, like stay in the bathroom stall and I just used to stay there all lunch and I remember I told my mum and then my mum and my dad went to school and they told the principal and then the principal was like that didn't happen like as if I was lying about getting bullied <clears throat> question seven have you ever been ashamed of being multiracial I don't think that I was ever ashamed of being multiracial, but when I was getting bullied, I kind of wished that I wasn't, like, multiracial, so they would stop bullying me, but I've never genuinely wished that I was just one culture, if that makes any sense at all. Do you feel that being mixed has its benefits? I definitely do think it does. It means that I can be a part of a bigger group of people. So, yeah, I would definitely say it does. What makes being multiracial a beautiful thing. I love when people come up to me, they're like, I think I know what your nationality is, but I'm not too sure, so I don't want to say. I don't know, I think that's just like the best conversation starter ever. I don't know if that answers the question, but I hope it does. Any advice to someone who struggles with their multiracial identity? Embrace it. Like seriously, there are so many multicultural or like mixed people out there, you're not alone. Don't ever feel ashamed or embarrassed, anything like that about who you are and what you are. Because seriously, who is somebody to tell you that you're not good enough? They have no right to say that to you. Never listen to them. You are you and you are beautiful, regardless of what anybody says. Everybody is unique and everybody's put on this planet for a reason. Don't ever let anybody make you feel ashamed of you being multiracial because it's seriously the most silliest thing I've ever heard in my whole life. Like, seriously. At the end of the day, we all have blood through our veins. We all have blood through our veins. We all have skin. It might be different tones. It might be different shades. But at the end of the day, who gives two fucks? Like, seriously. We're all on this planet and we're all in this planet together working together to create the best world possible. So why does it even matter what somebody's race is? Like, seriously. Okay, guys, so I think that I've answered all the tag questions. So, yeah, I hope you are having a wonderful day. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye.